Today I will demonstrate you how to use text view in Android Kotlin. So let's start developing Android Studio project. First of all, you can click on start new Android Studio project. Then you can choose the empty activity. Then you can click on next. Here you can provide the name of your application. I'm just giving the name of my application is text view demo. Then you can choose the language that uh, either you can choose the Java or Kotlin. I want to choose the Kotlin. So I'm just choosing the language Kotlin and then you can click on finish. Let me mention what I want to do. I want to use the text view and I want to uh, create the application like an article application in which uh, I want that the um, text view must contain the big text like uh, I want to uh, store the Siu Tandav in my text view. So let's uh, start with the designing first. First of all, you can click on activity main.xml file. Here you can click on show system user interface. Then uh, here you can see that the action bar will available over here. Then you can click on split the window. Then you can simply remove this text view. Now here you can uh, put any text view that whatever you want to put. I'm just putting the text view over here. And that uh, must be uh, in a center. So I'm just putting here and then you can click on info constraint. Then you can just give the title of your text view. I'm just uh, writing the title of my text view is, uh, for example, I want to write here Om Namah Shivaya. Then you can simply write here Om Namah Shivaya. Now you can uh, increase the font that if you want to use. Uh, I just want to set the text to size that is, for example, 15 point. Then you can just uh, set the text to style that is bold. Then you can give the text color that should be a primary dark. So the text color is primary dark now. And even you can uh, set the background if you want to set. I'm just giving the background is a set. So here you can see that the background is a set. Here also you can set the width. I'm just giving the width that is match parent. So your Om Namah Shiva will be available over here. Now you can uh, change the text color also. I'm just setting the text color is as app, app, app. So it will be white. <clears throat> now here you can uh, suppose if you think that my text should be available in the center of the text view, then you can just write here that is a gravity property. Here in using gravity property, you can make it center. So your Om Namah Shiva will be available within the center. Suppose if you think that I want the background is not assigned, I want the background is primary dark, then your uh, text field will be look like this. So I'm just setting the Om Namah CY. That is, that is my text view. Suppose if you think that, sir, can I write the Hindi uh, in text view? Yes, you can. So I'm just taking one more text view over here and that will be my article title. So I'm just taking here the second text view over here and here you can just uh, click on info constraint so this is my uh, article title here again i want that the background should be primary dark and a text color must be uh, has f f f so it should be white then you can change the text view uh, text if you want i'm just setting the text to style it should be bold then you can give the text to size for example, it is 10 point. Now, I want to set the text view title that is I want to write here Siv Tandav, but I want to write it in a Hindi. Then you can use the Google input. I'm just using the Google input. I'm just writing here in Hindi Siv Tandav. Right. So my Siv Tandav will be the title of this text view. Here you can see that, right? Even you can increase the you can make the changes over here if it is required. For example, it is 12 point, then you can see. You can also increase the text view value if it is required. This is my second uh, title of this text view. Now, I want that another uh, text view that should be available over here and it must contain a Siv Tando, right? So I'm just taking one more text view over here. You can just move drag and drop. Whenever you move drag and drop text view over here, you can click on info constraint. So your text view will be adjusted with your constraint layout. Now, I want to write the same kind of over here. So 
I have just uh, increasing the text size that is for example 10 point now I want to set the text over here so I have one Siv Tandav uh, that is a slope all the slopes are already downloaded over here you can all copy all this text but you can imagine if I paste all the text over here in this text property then definitely this my uh, layout design will not be looked properly so here if you have the text that is in multiple lines you can move to your project you can move to resource and then you can click on values here in values you can click on strings.xml and here you can set your string i'm just writing here string name is for example siv tandav so my name is a siv tandav and here i'm just pasting the content of the siv tandav whenever you put the content over here then you can move to your activity main.xml this text to number three you can write at the red string slash siv tandav so your siv tandav will be available over here whenever you execute this application you can see that this text view will not be scrollable so we want that whenever user uh, scroll this text view it must be scroll so whenever you execute this application you can see over here in this emulator what happens see yes you can see that this text view is not scrollable so what to do if I want to put here scrollable view right so here you can just simply cut your text view and after that you can simply search for this scroll view you can simply uh, move drag and drop your scroll view over here and then you can click on info constraint and after that this scroll view contains the linear layout you can remove this linear layout and here inside this scroll view you can paste your text view whenever you paste your text view here you can see that see my this application contains the text view inside the scroll view so here you can see that whenever you execute your application it will be scrollable see right all the slogs are scrollable see, but uh, i want that the after every slope i want the line new line right uh, for example here you can see that there is a one slope the jata tavi galajala pravaha pavitasthale after this chakara chanda tandavam tanotuna shivashivam after this first slope i want that the enter should be there so whenever you want to do like this at that time here what you can do here after this slope you can just press slash n slash n here you can press slash n slash n here also you can do the same you can copy these things and you can paste over here it means the slash n can be used to put the line between any uh, to put the new line a line separator as a line separator you can use the slash n so i'm just putting the slash n uh, after the every slope and here after putting the slash n you can see that uh, this th there are uh, 14 slopes are there see slash n slash n and after this it is around rhythm siv tandav stotram sampurnam after that i want to put a few more lines so you can execute this application and you can see that uh, see here after one slope there is a one uh, line gap see but after end of all these things i want to put uh, contact information or email address or website address like this so whenever you want to put uh, after uh, email address or uh, mobile number or any uh, card see suppose if you want to put here in text view then you can use the auto link property to put the link link in particular mobile number email address and web address so i'm just writing here thanks and regards and here after that you can just press a slash n then you can write dr parag shi shukla then you can press again slash n and after that you can just mention a website website is parag shukla dot com then you can just mention email address i'm just mentioning the email address for example pc shukla at aits.edu.in here you can press the slash n you can just uh, write the slash n also and here 
if you want to mention the mobile number then you also you can mention the mobile number i am just mentioning the mobile number is for example 0281256345 now i want that uh, this should be this mo uh, this my number should be uh, converted into dial paid this must be moved to email address and this must be moved me to uh, any browser so here whenever you execute this application you can just see that what happened uh, th this is my title uh, text view title text view is om namah Sivai. this is my second title that is siv tandav and here you can see that the inside scroll view i have a one text view but uh, here see you can see that the website is there parabshukla.com but it is not clickable so whenever you want to put a link inside your text view at that time here in this uh, your third text view you can just mention auto link you can mention the all now you can just execute your application and you can see that what happens see whenever you execute your application you can see by scrolling your text view inside your see here whenever you click on parakshukla.com uh, this is the link and this link will be convert uh, divert you to the browser and here my website will be open whenever you move back and whenever you click over here on pcsukla at aits.edu.in what happens see it will move me to my gmail application see and suppose if you think that i want to uh, whenever i click on this number it should be move me to uh, dial pad then you can just move to your number and here you can remove this zero then you can re-execute your application and you can check that whenever you re-execute your application now your number will be moved uh, you to the dial pad so here you can just see and whenever you click on this number it will move you to the dial pad so here depend upon the your requirement you can use a uh, web address even you can concatenate with map even you can concatenate with a uh, phone if it is required even you can concatenate with email if it is required and if you think that i want a uh, link in all these things then you can simply write all over here so this is the way you can implement text view in android that's it from my side. If you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.